Alright, I already played the song for that guy and got the heart piece out of it. Woo! I gotta go over here and get the Deku Stick upgrade, though. Okay. Well, that that's actually important, kind of. Wait, what does that do? Uh, you plant uh, a magic bean in it, and then when you grow into an adult, it becomes a plant that, like, teleports you. Oh, wow! That's... Give me my Deku Stick upgrade. I want my stick to be large. So now I can, I can hold twenty of them. I I just needed to spend the rupees somehow. Oh. Um. Now a question. Remind me again. What was the whole point of like doing that again? Oh, you just said it. Never mind. Man, yeah, I am I was, having. I was about to say to get the Deku Stick upgrade, dude. Oh. Damn. I mean, like you don't need the Deku Stick upgrade to beat the game. In fact, I don't get it on most of my playthroughs of this game, but oh, okay. <laughs> I just figured I needed a way to spend my rupees. Gotcha. Alright. Wait, I thought we discussed Actually. You, I thought you want to go down to uh, what, what you gonna fucking get? Uh, uh, oh yeah, the market to buy stuff? Yeah, the market, yeah. Actually, let me throw a bomb at this rock. Bomb. Fall down a hole. That didn't almost did not even look like a hole. That didn't look like a hole at the bottom of the sea. I see a fish. Yeah, if there's a fish in there, you can actually get the fish. Uh, that was not worth it. That was so not worth it. Yeah. There's probably a, sh a tombstone in there that you can actually put to some good use, but... Oh. I don't have the mass to do so. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna say I got money now. Yeah. Hold on, see excuse me? Yeah. So now, oh, okay. now I have a shortcut open, but there's no point in me being here. Oh. <laughs> there's no point in me being here whatsoever. Oh, I thought you just forgot something, because I'm like, I'm pretty sure you got everything. Oh, wait, wait. Did that work? What am I supposed to do? Oh, you're supposed to light that thing? I thought so. I don't. I don't remember how to activate it though. I don't. Okay, that's not how you activate it. So where's? Oh, I'm supposed to light torches. That's how I'm supposed to. Okay. I have to light the torches in the Well, I'm. I'm supposed to. Oh, like those torches. Yeah. Oh, there's a stick right. Oh, well, there's a torch right there. Yeah, there's a something right there I could use. I have 20 sticks, so. Eh, can't fail. Yes, Traveling Warrior, you can smash my bots, I don't mind. Well, him and I are brothers now, except uh. that I never accepted his Goron hug, so he might he might think <laughs> he yeah. might think that that's like very offensive, you know, kinda like the the Native Americans. You don't smoke the peace pipe, then it's just like, oh well, fuck you, we're gonna we're gonna kill you now. <laughs> I did don't remember that one. <laughs> okay. There we oh, go. Oh, that was it. Except Link, why are you spinning? <laughs> I was gonna say, <laughs> what, uh, Link? Oh. Oh, well, never mind. Okay, now I have a good use for these rupees. Oh, hey, look at that! I can buy this tunic! Dude! Or maybe not. Oh. Well, I can buy these bombs! <laughs> I like how this guy's just like, what's up, man? What's up, man? I'll buy some bombs. Hey man, thanks yeah. for like actually blowing up that cave that was that, <laughs> that wall that was holding me here. Yeah, I was <laughs> I was totally not getting any business whatsoever mm -hmm. because of that. In fact, I was starving to death in here. <laughs> I already ate all the rocks that I could eat. But you're surrounded by rocks. Though. Yeah, but those those are those aren't edible rocks. That's still I don't know. Okay. So there's a good reason to do this. Yo, he's selling out of control. It's out of control. It's out of control. So, it's getting out of. Oh, that's bombs. That's a worthwhile prize. Wow. Yeah, now, does that mean that you can just keep doing that, like spamming shit out of it? Yeah, I can spam. I can keep uh, spamming the shit out of this. What? So, but I gotta, I gotta make it land on the happy face so that I can uh, get a heart piece out of it. Oh, I didn't even realize it was a happy face. Yeah, it, yeah it's, it's got it's got three faces. The angry face is rupees. The smile is uh, bombs, and then the happy face is uh, okay. Well, I don't need to go down there and collect those bombs again. Well, 
Okay, well... Oh, I actually did make it in. I didn't even think you made that one, actually. <laughs> I didn't think I, I made it either. Come on. Yeah! Uh, yes. Oh, yo! And, and money? And money? And money? Yo! I got, I got love and money? <laughs> I I, com I completed a whole heart. I was gonna run over you. <laughs> I, yeah, I was actually really hoping that it wouldn't run me over. It's like I got love and money out of doing that. Who says money can't buy you love? Uh, I, I don't. Like <laughs> I mean, eh? <laughs> it can buy you fake love, but it's still love. Yeah, but that's fake love, though. Like, yeah, but it's still love. I, it it depends on how high you hold your standards. Okay, you have a point there. Like, if you just want to be like, hey, I... I oh, yeah, I, for, I forgot I have this move now, so... Oh, yeah, because the sword. I totally forgot what the hell happened. Mm. Uh, well, last time we saved the Dodongos. That's... The, okay. And, yeah. and by save them, I mean we just bombed the shit out of them and killed them all. We, and, and we, we end their suffering. We ended their <laughs> suffering. We saved them from... Wait, what? We saved them from life. Okay, so gray rocks you actually can't blow up. Really? Yeah, I forget what you have to do to destroy gray rocks. I want to say you have to lift them, but I can't lift them with the Goron bracelet. I have to have the silver gauntlets, which is an item that's like way, 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 way later in the game. Wow. And you're kind of also a child, too, so... Yeah. I kind of like this whole game where, like, it just, like, you grow up to an adult and things that you do in a patch is a mess. Like, I like that. Although some shit doesn't make any sense. Like what? Uh, well, there's a causal loop that, for, for when you, um, learn the Song of Storms. Oh, that's a purple rupee. This is another purple rupee. I just remembered that. Ow! <laughs> Mimic chat! Sorry, no. Yeah, this this actually is a purple ruby, so I don't want to pick it up because uh, and I just remember that it, I'm just I'm just gonna end up wasting it. I'm gonna have to remember that it's there next time I want it. Weird. I know for a fact it's a purple ruby though. Okay. Watch you come back and it's like completely something. I could I come back and it's like a heart piece and it's like oh son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's get the hell out of here. There's yeah. there's nothing more for me to do over here. Goodbye, Goron City. Goodbye, Goron City. You guys are still fucking weird. I'm sorry, I never really liked these guys. Especially in this one, because they look like just porcupines. Because they look like porcupines? Yeah, that's what I thought the longest time. I'm like, are these motherfuckers porcupines? Okay, well, we're not gonna drop down that. That's nothing. That's death. <laughs> that is most certainly death. I think I just saw Goron just eat shit and blow up. He, he did eat shit and blow up, but he's still alive. Oh, I'm okay. Aww. Aww. He rejected my offer. I don't think you can just break it up by doing it. Oh, by rolling? That's a thing in most Zelda games. That's a game. That's a thing in video games in general, actually. You can break your fall by, uh, by rolling. Like, if you're moving forward. Which makes sense. Oh. Oh. Can you get that one? No, I can't actually. Oh. I need the boomerang to get it. Oh. I actually, I let me let me try it. Yeah. Nope. I most certainly need the boomerang to get that. I was like, yeah, never mind. I thought jumping attack would probably get it. Maybe the sword would count, I guess. I don't know. But... Like, yeah, you would you would think. How many gold skull tallers do I have? I think I have eight now. Yeah. Wow. Look at you go, dude. Yeah, I just, I just need ten. I just need ten. That'll be, that'll be good. Sweet. Now, refresh my memory. What happens if you get ten? <laughs> uh, I get the adult size wallet. Oh! Oh, that is really good, actually. Yeah, right? it's, it's actually really, really helpful. Mm. Chickens. Yeah, don't fuck with the chickens. Yeah, I learned that the fucking hard way. You learned? <laughs> you didn't learn it the hard way. You you learned it in Breath of the Wild, which is a game which is a game that surprisingly does not punish you enough for attacking cuckoos. Is uh oh, this one punishes even more. Oh yeah, this one, Link to the Past. Uh, 
<laughs> all the old school Zelda games, they punish you hard for that shit. Like they actually like kill you, kill you. Yeah, they will. They will hunt you down to the ends of the fucking earth. Jesus Christ. Okay. It's like playing Dark Souls too. I'm not gonna ask you to do that, so don't do it. <laughs> you want to actually know something is that now nowadays, like video games, whenever they try to pose any kind of challenge, it automatically gets compared to Dark Souls. It was like, oh, there's a challenge. That means the game is as hard as Dark Souls, and it's like. Well, yeah. The thing about Dark Souls was that game where it's like it was the first one that actually challenged people. You know, like. That's, well, I, I want to say it was like the only game, but I'm pretty sure there was other games that actually challenged people. Where like, shit is hard, and things will kill you. Things can kill you. So when other game, like other games, start could like get uh, into that level where like, oh, this game is just like it's made to basically. Makes you think on your toes, reaction time is more important, dodging, blocking, all that stuff like that, hit frames and stuff like that. Well, it wasn't the first ever game to do any of this stuff, to be well, a yeah. challenging game. It's well, one, I, I guess it, it'd be like one of the, like, it was, it'd be like a break in between all of the uh, easy, uh, modern uh, shooter games and stuff. Well, yeah. Where it's like, you, oh, yeah, get, nice. you get a game over, but you start back at the checkpoint like with five new lives. Pikachu for some fucking it's, it's actually a spoof of Pikachu. So uh -huh. there's uh, there's actually a very good reason I'm getting this mask. Okay, but yeah, like I know, like it gets kind of annoying when some people say like, "Oh man, this game is just like Dark Souls or whatever." But there's some that do, there's some that don't. Like oh, but, Neo. But, 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 I just I just remembered there's something else I can do in the market. Okay. Well, actually, no. Neo was actually kind of was the same company as Dark Souls, I think, or what? Oh, Neo. Uh, Neo wasn't made by the same people, but it was made in like the same respects. Um, oh no, a customer. Sleeping on the job. <laughs> yep, Bombshoe Bowling Alley. Did we even do this one? No. So I just skipped over all our texts because I already know how to play the game. What can I win? Oh, I'm gonna get that right away. Do it. Yeah, I I want to do it. I don't I don't want to mess this up. All right, so that was easy. Now these bomb shoes are kind of finicky. Ooh. Um. Wow. So. You want? Oh my God! Why is there a chicken? You want a challenge? Oh, uh, there, there's a the chicken actually. Like you can't actually get chickens summoned here. It's it's just there to block the bomb. If you hit the chicken, then it's enough times, and it'll like no. This game, this game isn't that merc merciless. I really don't want to lose this game. Okay, well, I have to get it past Big Chicken there. Yes, huh? nice, dude. I got the heart piece. Sweet. This is the best prize ever. Let's yes, again. let's play again. Let's see what else I can win. Bombs. A bomb. Well, ironically, I'm going to win bombs at a bomb shoe bowling alley. <laughs> yeah, I thought I could win a bomb bag from here. Bomb bag? Yeah. Oh, that makes you hold like, more bombs? Yeah, hold more bombs. Okay. Okay, I'm going to ask, do you have like, any control of that thing? Uh, after throwing it, no. So it's just wow. Ah, oh, damn it. So it just kind of goes on its own, right? Yeah. Well, um, I lose. Uh, hey, you got a heart. I did. I did get a heart piece for it. I thought you actually meant to hit that fucking chicken. Do you want to play again? No. No! You. I hit B on yes. Oh, there's the bomb bag. Oh, hey, look at that. <laughs> I hit B on yes and it said, do you want to play again? It's like, okay, well. well it's a good thing you did. It, it is a good thing I did, actually. <laughs> Okay, Ooh. that was bullshit. Oh. Damn. Oh, I thought that was like a booster or something. No, shit. it's a bumper. Oh. And 
And usually bumpers and bowling are good things, but no, not in this game. I was going to make fun of people like, Oh, he's using a bumper, he's not a real bowler. <laughs> he's not a real bowler because well, he's... Of course, he's not... like, that's just hard, man. <laughs> oh, oh my god, oh. this is terrible. Oh no. I don't know, man. Because it's always this side one. It's always this left one that even gave me trouble as a kid. What? Oh. Okay, well that's definitely uh, the way to throw it. What? That pillar knocked that out of the way. Well, honestly, dude, I don't, I don't think we can get hit this one. Yep, yeah, nope. Nah, I don't need the bomb bag. You sure? I don't have enough money. Oh. I have zero rupees now. Hey, well, there you go, you got no money now. I think that's what you wanted. Yeah, it is what I wanted actually. Oh, okay. I wanted to have no money. <laughs> well, just to remember, that's that money that purple would be in Yeah, if I, if I ever need something, I can always use that. Okay. Plus, you know, the bomb bag's not a big deal at the moment. Oh. I'm not the bomb bag. Well, the bomb bag makes you hold more bombs, right? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. So I, I think there are two bomb bag upgrades, so cool. you can hold up to 40 of them. Jeez! 40 bombs! Oh, there's actually another game in the market that I could play, but I don't want to play it without the Lens of Truth. It's basically a game where you go through like five rooms consecutively, and you have to get the key to those rooms. And uh, the loser, the loser chest is actually like just a rupee or something. But at the end is a heart piece. Oh. I was gonna say, like, the loser thing did not so bad, but then you said the heart piece, and I'm like, okay, never mind, I take that back, actually. <laughs> yeah, because it's like, the first two rooms... Or the first room is like a green ruby. If you don't make it past the first room, it's just like, oh, hey. And it's basically a guessing game, trying trying to get through it. Or you could just use the lens of truth and cheat and see through the chest to see which one's the right one. <laughs> okay, so I came back to Cockrico for a good reason. Because this dude was actually just like, whoa, what? You have a Keaton mask? Do you think your disguise is a hero? Is that a a key something he doesn't he has never he's never heard of a very popular thing you just sell it to me but <laughs> he's never gonna get to the boy he just yay i earned a little profit go to the mask shop and pay back the mask price of 10 rupees wait uh... yeah so this is uh, basically the mask quest, where you oh. have to uh, get these uh, masks, wear them around, and then you find somebody in the world who will uh, want to buy the masks from you. Oh, cool. Some of them give you a profit, some of them give you a freaking deficit. That does not sound good. Yeah, this this next mask, I'm pretty sure, it's like a 20 ruby mask, but the dude I sell it to is only going to pay me 10. What? What a dick. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, can't get this mask from me, it's like 20, so here's a 10. But... What? Wait, no, wait, what? <laughs> Alright, watch how fast this night lasts. That moon was flying. <laughs> <laughs> I, think it, I think that was even the Majora's Mask that went just like that. The, the moon just went flying. <laughs> Oh my god. So it, it's, believe... it's like when someone dropped the moon. Someone I... was just like, You, you know fell what? through I'm that staircase. Yeah, I fell through the staircase. <laughs> and it's like, okay, yeah, you know what? The moon's coming up. But actually, no, I forgot something. And then the moon just falls. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck? Oh, <laughs> uh, where, where am I going? Oh, I'm going over here. Mass, mass up again. But, um... That fucking Smash Brothers fucking stage, where Majora's fucking <laughs> mode just comes roaring down towards the stage. I cannot get that out of my mode. Right, I'm gonna borrow the skull mask. You feel like a monster while you wear this mask. So I can, you can actually wear these masks and like talk to NPCs and they have stupid reactionary bullshit like, oh my god, why are you wearing that mask? Like like this lady. How irritating. <laughs> Wow. wow. Go go to the couple. 
What does the couple have to say? <laughs> Just pretend we're on our own purpose. Wow. Do they say anything different? Oh, yeah, they say something different, but I don't care what they have to say. <laughs> Like, <laughs> 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 what the fuck? What the fuck is that shit? What the hell? <laughs> they start running. <laughs> okay. Oh, back to Kakariko we go. Did it, did it take the mask off? Because I ran through the. Okay. Hey! That's not great. Oh. I thought that was a kid. Wait, what? Okay, I guess he's not the kid. That I sell this mask to. Who do I give this mask to? Okay, what is what does this guide say? This crazy mask map where it's had like almost over a hundred goddamn characters. Okay, this this freaking website is I can't play a game and navigate this website at the same time because it's intrusive. <laughs> Raw unedited gameplay, DSP style. <laughs> I guess I do. And talk to him. <laughs> so, yeah, it actually is the same Skull Kid that uh, is basically the main villain in Majora's Mask. See, I wanted, I wanted to ask you that question, but I feel like, nah, this... No, nope, it's, it's the same guy. Because, I swear, sometimes in the Zelda timeline, it's kind of confusing. You lost money on that deal. Go back to the mask shop and pay 20 rupees for the mask. Difference when they have to come out to your own pockets. Yeah. You're a dick. Yeah. There's there's actually a reference uh, to that dude being the same guy at the end of Majora's Mask, where like the dude sniffs him and he's just like, "You smell like the boy from the Kokiri Forest that I met." It's like. Oh yeah, that's right. Because there's different links. Ah. Well, not between Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. Oh. It's the same one. Oh, it's the same. Oh. I thought like a different timeline was different links. Well, yeah, there's usually it's usually a different link in pretty much every game, but not Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. Ah, okay, okay. Like Majora's Mask is like a direct, direct sequel. Ah, okay. I'm not too good with the timeline, honestly. <laughs> now the timeline's a little bit weird, especially with uh, Breath of the Wild concerned right now. Yeah, I'm still trying to figure that shit out. I want to say that it's on the same timeline as Majora's Mask and Twilight Princess, but it's set so far into the freaking future that uh, pretty much all of the games that have come before it have pretty much just become legend at this point. I'm sorry, but there was money in that tree. Did someone just throw that shit up there? <laughs> yeah, somebody just threw a rupee in a tree. You know what? I'm you good. know what? <laughs> I mean, could you imagine just having a giant green rupee like that just only being worth one cent? And it's like just pocket change? Like, would you want to carry that shit around? Yeah, you got it. Like, I don't, I don't even want to carry loose change in my pocket. <sighs> oh, there's a bomb over there. Or, not a bomb, there's a rock that's bombable over there. Let me get this rupee again. Always fall into that ground, man. <laughs> yeah. That's always... That actually happens in Majora's Mask as well. If you go into a loading zone while in the air, you'll fall through the ground. <laughs> Okay, what is the fuck is that going to be about the deal with those people just all in that one little, uh... Uh, market? there's probably a Black, a Black Friday sale. <laughs> Payment received. Okay, then we give this mask to the kid. What the fuck? That's not even... Okay, that is... It is a, it, it's a spoopy mass. <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's a spoopy mass. Does it really say spoopy mass? No, it says spooky mass. Oh, okay. Oh my god, actually, now that I have the... It's a spooky mask and not just like a... A, a skull mask. Let's see. Ah, what the fuck is your problem? <laughs> <laughs> What's your problem? <laughs> I can't see what I'm doing. Okay, what does this dude have to say? This big burly dude, he's like, A mask? When I was a kid, I was also a mask in What? You say you can't imagine me doing that? No! Okay, what's what's up with these shoppers? Uh. Yeah! What's your problem? <laughs> yeah, that was a weird one! Yeah! What's your problem? <laughs> they, they scream it like, uh, you
like uh, it won't get fooled again. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> new boss. Oh, fuck you, rock. And this rock leads into a hole. This hole is probably completely oh, worthless. Oh, oh. Let me guess, five rupees? And it's a heart. Oh, never mind. So I'm just gonna say that most of them are just like rupees. Yeah, they're okay. all rupees. Oh, hey, I'm, g I'm gonna wear the spooky mask. <laughs> the and skeleton's and gonna look at it like, whoa, what the fuck, dude? Yeah, yeah, hopefully it'll scare the style children away. Or maybe better yet, they'll think that, uh, nope. Nah. nah. None of these masks have secondary effects on the world, unfortunately. No. Actually, the only one that does is the bunny hood. If you wear the bunny hood while out here, then the style children won't pop out. Really? Actually, it doesn't look like they're popping out right now. Maybe they think I'm one of them. I'm sorry, but that they're, actually they're not, kind of they're creepy. They're not, they're not, they're not, they're not, oh yeah, that is very creepy. Oh. They're not popping out for some reason. There you are. Okay, yep, they're not fooled by the mask. <laughs> I just saw you put it on, like, really? <laughs> <laughs> you want a credit card? <laughs> okay, well, I need it to be daytime for the kid to be here, so... Otherwise, uh, it's just gonna be the gravekeeper. Who gives a, who gives no fucks about you moving tombstones, by the way. <laughs> he just kinda looks at like, mm. You know, I could do something about this, but... Nah, nah, not my job. <laughs> actually, actually, it is your job. <laughs> eh, they don't pay me enough for it. I'm actually on break. <laughs> I'm actually on break. <laughs> I'm on a six-hour break for an eight-hour shift. Or a 12-hour oh twelve-hour shift. <laughs> Damn, that's is... six-hour break and an eight-hour shift. <laughs> like, excuse me. <laughs> like, do we even want to work? <laughs> no. Why would you go to work and want to work? That's a really good question. <laughs> Why can't people just pay me money to show up and hold down the fort? Why would you... This looks nothing like the Gravekeeper. Yeah, it's a little kid. Can you give me that mask? Man? Yes. With this mask, I'll be just like that people. Here's my... Oh, Jesus! Fuck! Oh, hey! The little kid didn't mind paying full price for the mask. Wow. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm gonna dig, dig me some holes, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I think he just created a fucking murderer, probably. <laughs> uh, he was he was destined to be a murderer anyway. Yeah, cause the kid hangs around the fucking graveyard. What kid hangs around the fucking graveyard? Uh, skateboarders, dude. You know what? Damn, yeah, <laughs> they're, they're always hanging out in the graveyard. Them damn skateboard kids with their mongoose flips and their kick tricks and your dick flips. Riders on a mission. <laughs> always an action fit. <laughs> what the fuck? Alright. <laughs> action kids in play position. That's the one. <laughs> Couldn't remember that one. Rocket Power. Tony Hawk was actually on an episode of Rocket Power. Oh yeah, I remember that now. You remember that? Where yeah. they went into his super secret hideout where they just... Uh, what was it? Uh, it was like a super secret hideout and then it was... Uh, it was a hideout and it turned out that it had like everything. It had like um, it had like this, this, this like... space skateboarding ramp like, like 10 stories in the air and it's like, well, God forbid you fall off here. And there was also like a snowboarding... Uh, little area. But he doesn't even snowboard. <laughs> yeah, but he's Tony Hawk. He can afford it. He's uh, an athlete. You know what? You're not even wrong on that. Uh, let's borrow the bunny hood. Wow, you are not driven like the bunny hood. That's... The hood's long ears are so cute. Alright, what's the reaction with this game? Uh, it's, it's probably very... Actually, fuck it. I don't care to show it off because it's not going to be hilarious. Oh, okay. mm. Let's try two more attempts at this bomb game. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. I'm <laughs> my boss. 
Oh, it's just a job. Okay, no. Uh, I thought you were my DM. <laughs> <laughs> my district manager. Um, oh, hey, bomb bag. Yeah, bomb bag right away. Good shit. Uh, just a little bit of skew, but I can't adjust accordingly because the thing is so fucking sensitive. Yeah, and plus, you know, Nintendo 64, that, that shit hasn't really aged well. <laughs> let me let me just try this. Uh, oh, that's tricky. It goes with the like you know the craziness. Eh, eh, yeah. Hey. All right, so now I have five attempts at this shit. Oh shit, that was bad. Now you got four attempts. <laughs> <laughs> no, move, chicken. Oh! Chicken move. Well, that does. Chicken, get the fuck out the way. I'm so glad there's like no time. No, bah, 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 yeah! Fuck you! Yeah. I got the bomb bag! Sweet! Now we can hold more bombs. Oh! And I think those are the only two prizes I can get from the bomb shoe bowling alley. That's actually important? Or... Yeah, a big bomb bag. Now you can carry 30. Hey. Okay, be sure to select no and then hit A, because if you hit B, even if it's highlighted on yes, it'll make you play again. <laughs> I know you want to play again, goddamn. That was so fucked up, though. It's just like, what? <laughs> it's like, honestly, kid, I need the money, really. My DM, like, my DM keeps seeing that, thinking that I'm falling asleep, so I need the money, honestly. <laughs> Why stop falling asleep, then? Well, actually, you can either wear the bunny hood, or you can stay on this path to keep the style children from popping out. And there should be just a random dude running around in Hyrule Field that you give this bunny hood to. Oh. I was like, I'm trying to find this postman. Postman. Or not, he's not a postman, he's just a dude who runs around. Okay, so how many moves do you give for this? Oh, he maxes out your wallet. Oh. What the hell? What the fuck, my man? Where are you? So oh, I have to beat the next temple in order to do it. Okay. Oh, well, okay. Alright, so... What? Well, you're ahead of it now. Yeah, I'm, I'm ahead of the quest now. He doesn't show up until after I beat the next temple. Which we just thought of it now. 